Good morning and happy Monday, my beautiful YouTube family. Today for Misty's Mask Monday, I am going to be using this Bloom Effects Dutch Dirt Mask. I did receive this in my Ipsy subscription for the month of April. I'm pretty excited about this. I am going to apply it with my Luxie 510 um, foundation brush. I don't typically use the flat foundation brushes for foundation, so... I'm going to apply this to my face um, and then I'll go over more details about I'll go over more details about this company and this mask. I am going to place this on my glass palette. One thing I have noticed even with testing um, or showing everybody on from doing that video, it can get a little watery and runny. So I really shook it up this time. And now it's a thicker consistency. So we're going to go ahead and apply it to my face. It's a very gritty feeling, but it is, um, it exfoliates the face and you can use it as an exfoliator. And you can see I got it on my glass palette and it looks very bad. It feels nice going on the face. It's nice and cooling. I don't smell fragrance. And I am not going to go so close to the eye area, about there. Apply an even layer, allow mask to dry, leave on for 20, leave on for 10 to 20 minutes, and then rinse. Now that I have finished applying um, this mask, I need to leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes. I'm going to try for 15, but definitely 10 minutes for sure. I just don't like putting new things on my face and leaving it on too long. Although it doesn't feel bad right now, it's still cooling. It's very nice. I'll give you a little bit of information about this brand. First, it's vegan and cruelty free. They're clean beauty. No parabens, no sulfates, no phthalates, no fragrance, and no synthetic dyes. The ingredients are as follows. I'm reading it down below, sorry. The active ingredients are as follows. Bloom Effects Proprietary Dutch Tulip Complex, which is rich in antioxidants, natural moisturizing factors and amino acids for softer, smoother, and glowing hydrated skin. Other ingredients are the prickly pear enzyme and that's going to help eliminate dead skin cells. Flower acid helps increase cell turnover and the skin's ability to eliminate dead skin cells. Sodium lactate Nature's identical form of sodium lactate, a natural moisturizing factor. Hydrolonic acid, a powerful ingredient and natural humectant, proven to draw in moisture. And then the company uh, for their details on this mask, it's a natural botanical extracts, floral enzymes, and our proprietary Dutch tulip complex help detox 
purify and deeply exfoliate. Think of it as a reset button for your skin, clean, fresh, and completely clarified. So I am truly excited for this. I will say it feels cool, but a little tingly. Oh, my face feels so chilled. If you haven't done so yet, go ahead and check out my video from yesterday, which would have been Sunday the 12th. It is a very chatty giveaway video. I will leave that giveaway video up in the cards here, or you can just search my YouTube site. I am so excited to be able to give back to you guys. You, you guys are amazing. It has been 15 minutes and the mask has dried down. I am going to go rinse it off and then I'll be back and give you my thoughts on this mask. I got the mask rinsed off. Uh, it didn't take very long. You know, you just wet it and then I used a washcloth and kind of exfoliated my nose area and my chin. My face feels very, very soft. This mud mask is not, or dirt mask, this dirt mud mask is not irritating my skin at all and it's not making it feel dry. So I like it and I do believe I forgot to say the price. So this is a two ounce mask. It retails for $49. I like it. When I run out, I will be contemplating whether or not I should purchase another one. I do like it. It did make my skin feel really nice. If something changes, I will definitely keep you guys posted. But yeah, it, my face feels soft and nice. I'm going to go ahead and get ready for the day and then I'll hop back on and I'll let you know how everything applied and if I still have the same thoughts. See you in a bit. Okay, guys. I wanted to come back on and let you guys know that my makeup applied very nicely today on my face. Uh, I did not have any irritation. My skin feels very hydrated and clean. I know that it exfoliated my nose. So I would recommend this mask. I do like it. I think it works very nice. It's nice that it's, you know, cruelty free. I like the fact that this is considered clean beauty. Um, they don't have, there's no parabens, no sulfates, no phthalates, no fragrance, and no synthetic dyes. So overall, it's a very nice mask. I am very grateful and happy that I did receive this in my Ipsy for the month of April. Oh my gosh, I, kept, I keep thinking we're in March and we're not. I really do like it and I do recommend it. I do hope you guys found this video to be helpful. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, be part of my amazing YouTube family. Um, it's been a great journey. Anyway, you guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Much love.